Well, a very confident stride. James Neesham possessed as he walked to the crease. He's been inspired by what's happened in front of his eyes while he's been sitting waiting. And now it's his turn. Here's Shami. New ball has worked the trick for MS Stoney. Straight into it. And Muhammad Shami, to his credit, right on the mark. Oh, and he's away. Jamie Nation, so he'd be happy about that. He waited for eight and a half hours with his pads on. Collectively, 123 overs. So this is a strange feeling to be all of a sudden out there and thrust into it. Oh, down, is it? I think it might be. Did it carry? Did it carry? Rahani is the fielder. Was that an opportunity? Did it get through? It looks like it might have. He's one of the uh, safest of fielders, generally. But it was, uh, it, these are the kind of catches that either stick in your hand or they come out. It's a tough catch. White. Lovely shot. Piece of timing from Nisham. He enjoys that area. Well, this was an outstanding shot because he'd not been beaten the ball before, but he was a little uncertain of the one that was moving away from him. This was the other one from Zahir Khan, designed to come back in and have you overbalancing as you try to cover off stump and the ball swinging away. But his balance was good. Straight down the ground for four. This is very good from Jimmy Nisham. Advancing the score, advancing matters, taking that scoring pressure away from Brendan McCullum. He's doing a good job. It's the start of what would be an outstanding job. Through the gap and away for four. Finishes the over with a boundary. It's 4.92 for six. Oh, what a shot that is from James Nisham. Up and over the top. Beautiful shot for four. 500 up for New Zealand. Oh, it's gone through. It's gone through and it'll race away for four. A little bit of a touch to it. But not enough to stop it. Oh, over the top. Nicely struck from Nisham. One bounce and away to the boundary. Yep. Good shot. And 50 for Jimmy Nisham as well. He deserves it. He's played so well. And throw 550 into uh, that as well. Well, this is his first test match. Remember that. He came uh, out under severe pressure in the first innings and played his natural game, and he looked very good. Oh, excellent placement. Sat on the back foot and waited for it. Surging ahead, New Zealand. There are players back, but that is just so beautifully placed. The ball's there to hit, hit it hard. Prepared to just shuffle down and use his feet. Placement was superb. And she goes over the top. And away through mid-wicket for four. piece of timing oh that's exquisite man who played a number of those but from the other side of the bat is now in commentary Sonny Gavaska oh this He's is alongside Craig McMillan and Ian Smith this is a terrific shot edge and away through the gap for four 
Things are going quite nicely for New Zealand this morning. Couple of edges. Four more. Much more controlled this one from Jimmy Neesham. Boundaries, two of them in the over. Eight for New Zealand's cause. Neesham, 94. It's 16 for six. The semblance of a chance that Jimmy Neesham is 98. <laughs> There's just a hint there that he had hit it down the throat of the man at deep backward square. Oh. Well, they could push for two here. They can go. They can go. And Neesham has it. Special, I doubt it. No, it can't be. It is a wonderful hundred. Yes, he came in when uh, the team was relatively safe, but still, to bat in the manner that he has, magnificent stuff. 15 boundaries in that hundred. Just tells you how well the young man has played.